Anesthesia is a critical part of surgery, but one of two theaters at St. Trust Hospital has been dysfunctional because it's lacked appropriate equipment. Medical superintendent at the hospital, Dr. Thomas Ajakupoku, describes the intervention as a huge relief as the hospital's two theaters will become operational. He says the hospital has had to rely mostly on Kofonochi Teaching Hospital in times of emergency. To the MP, uh, Mr. Ochem, for the donation of anesthetic machine. In fact, it was uh, one of our urgent needs, and we told him. Uh, now we have two theaters, yet we have only one anesthetic machine, which means that virtually we are all using one. A uh, patient have to queue. Patient who needs surgery have to queue for a long time. Emergencies have to wait, or we refer. So with the donation of an anesthetic machine, is going to boost our operation, especially at the theater. We have surgeons, but we didn't have anesthetic machine. So we are grateful to him for the machine. Mr. Ochema Boaji says he procured the equipment from three years' accumulation of his health fund. About two years ago, there was a woman that was going to have a baby, and she passed on. I think she passed on the baby because they didn't get a machine to operate her on uh, in time. And so that was a big blow for me when I heard the news. And I said, no, something has to change. So when I had a chance to come and visit, I didn't just want to come and throw anything at them. I wanted to actually provide them support with what they need. It is important for you to provide what people need and what you think they need. So when I came about four or five months ago and they told me about it, I started working in my National Health Insurance Fund. And gradually, gradually, I've been able to secure uh, that fund, my three years accumulated fund, to bring to support uh, with a fight for the machine that they are looking for. So that is my motivation. And my motivation is that life, is, life is, is more important, especially the life of a pregnant woman. Especially that is going to bring, like, what do you call life? Another life onto earth should not die. And that is why I'm so motivated. Nana Asensu Mensa, reporting.